Tourists and locals are enjoying the unusually warm spring and early bloom in Boston's public garden. However, for China Altman, who's been leader of the Public Garden's Rose Brigade for 25 years, the change in weather is concerning. These unusual weather conditions, I really don't want these. I don't want these roses to bloom now. It's like it's mid-April, and they usually have their first big emergence in mid-June. So this is two months early. The Parks and Recreation Department has noticed the change in bloom as well. Tom Williams, the city's superintendent of horticulture, fears this will affect how long the flowers last. The lilacs in my yard are in bloom already, and so they're not going to last another three and a half weeks. The Parks and Rec Department, along with the Rose Brigade, are adjusting to the changes to continue caring for the garden. The main thing that we can do with this unusual weather is observe them and see what our intuition and our former observations and knowledge might have told us. For those who nurse the garden, the weather has raised concerns. However, visitors don't seem to mind the early bloom. And I walked over here today because I knew that you would have trees in bloom. And the weather's perfect to be outside and it's perfect to get to see something in bloom. Although the weather could possibly affect the natural cycle of the garden's flowers, their caregivers will still be there to maintain their beauty. For WEBJ News, I'm Brianna Baxter.